slacker. First bite of the day. Oh, that feels like a decent one. Number one, shake your head. Definitely chase around over there. Holy crap. If they just come this way. I might do it at some point. Mm -hmm. What's my rods back here? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's a better fish. <laughs> <laughs> We hook it on now, boys. <laughs> Number two.
Heck yeah. Oh my god! Come on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's close. It's three. <laughs> Hook fell out. Well, good, you know I have to full taking it out. That's a three pounder, I bet. I don't know. Look at that one boys. Two and a half. Having fun now. Number three. You started contributing. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm telling you something like I had to send hook. I'll tell you what. Man, I wish he's a little bigger, though. It would not be the extra we need to get 20 pounds. Number four. I think flat out catches them, dude. It's just. Got the lost mine, you know what I mean? There you go, good. Oh, oh, dude. That was a good fish. God, dude. Dude. That's a freaking giant.
Chris, big Chris. Yeah, right there. Look right here. Look at that. Is that a that's part? That's part. That's that was a There's another one here right back here. That's a good one, dude. Yep. Dude, How did you miss that? I don't know. That's a big fish. Yeah. <laughs> Add some bass to it. I don't even have it that second time. Yeah, you did. I throw a worm over or something. He's still there. You know he's still there. Well, you want me to throw mine over? Yeah. If you can't get him. Hey guys, just a little recap on a tournament. We came in fourth out of nine boats. 
We had 10.35 pounds. Winners had 13 something. Second had 13 something. And uh, we knew it was going to be tough because for three days in a row prior to the day we got there, there was a big tournament up there and the lake got pounded. So we decided to go way up lake, try and get away from everybody and try to find some stuff that may didn't get hit as bad. And uh, we found four or five schools. Really only got one to fire and uh, just picked, had a one or two bites off every other spot we stopped at. Never caught anything really big off of them. And, um, but the only thing we could get bit on was top water and dragging a bottle. The top water, I was throwing a bone colored vixen and Eddie was throwing a a spook type bait also and uh, we were just whenever we see them blow up on shad we throw into them then later in the day we went shallow for about the last hour and a half and uh, got around a bunch of cicadas so I switched to a darker color popper because everything was eating those cicadas I even had a carp come up and try to eat my popper I had to pull it away from it and uh, the only other thing that we could get bit on, I tried the Carolina rig, I tried deep diving crankbait, tried a big swim bait, tried a spoon, a big worm, a 10 inch worm or a 12 inch worm. And uh, this was it four inch yum danger. On a quarter ounce, it was a Strike King bowhead jig. That was it. Green pumpkin. And uh, Eddie was throwing a watermelon seed trick worm on a shaky head. And that was it. That's the only thing we got bid on. And uh, that was the last tournament for the season for USA Bassin. And for the points, overall, we came in fifth out of 20. And uh, so I, I think that was pretty good. We didn't win anything, but we had fun. I didn't come in last. <laughs> but, uh, and we didn't fish one tournament because they scheduled it on Mother's Day. So we didn't even fish that one. Um, but season's over, but I'm still going fishing. So I should be I should be uploading at least two videos a month. And I'll fish all year long and my boat don't get a break in the wintertime. So uh, we went fishing on Chickamauga a couple years ago. And it was, I think it was January, late January, early February. And it was, uh, I think it was 20, 28 degrees, something like that. We were knocking the ice out of the guides, dipping the rods in the water. And it was, it was rough. But, uh, yeah, I fish all year long. So, if you haven't subscribed yet, you better subscribe. And, uh, if you want, I'm fishing mainly Douglas this year. That's all I'm going to fish until winter time. Then I'll... I might go to Cherokee and try to learn that drop shotting or the Mickey rig. I haven't really got to do that yet. And uh, I'll be going back to Chickamauga in the, in the winter time when there ain't nobody on the lake and you can actually fish it. So, uh, yep, if you haven't subscribed, just do it and pass the word around. Share some videos. I got to get to a thousand subscribers, you know. Help, help me out, y'all. Yeah? But, uh, yep, at least two videos a month, maybe more. If you see me out on a lake, just holler at me. I usually wear the same stuff, khaki pants and a blue shirt. Come say hi. I'll tell you what they biting on or what they ain't biting on. 